It is an epidemic that is sweeping the nation. We have all dealt with it in some sort of way, whether you're a victim of it or you're suspect of it, which I think a lot of us are, especially if you have social media, it has definitely affected your life in some way. And that, my friends, is the selfie. Now, before we get started, I want to make something clear. I'm not condemning anyone for taking pictures of themselves because I'll admit it, I've taken a picture of myself. It happens. I mean, who takes better pictures of yourself than yourself? This video is more in light of the word itself. In the past year, the word selfie has blown up. It was added to the online Oxford Dictionary, and more recently, it was named the 2013 Word of the Year. Here's the definition that the Oxford Dictionary has for selfie. Photograph that one has taken of oneself, typically with a smartphone or webcam, and uploaded to a social media website. And then in the little subtext that always comes with the definition, it says, occasional selfies are acceptable, but posting a new picture of yourself every day is not necessary. So, my friends, don't overdo it. In case you're still unsure what this selfie phenomenon is, myself and my amazing friends have provided some examples for you. I mean, even celebrities are doing it and trying to make themselves look better. Like Justin Bieber, Kim Kardashian, and even the presidential family. So go and be free with the world and take as many selfies as you want because it's okay and it's accepted in society. Just don't post them every day because the Oxford Dictionary does say so.